morning. Um, thank you all for coming this morning. Um, today we have the guest author or speaker here is Tim Tiffinick. Um, he's a Bible author around New Zealand for children's, um, children's books. This fellow, we, um, we met him at Speed Data Author, and that was an event that um, the few year teams went to last year and the year. And I've got to say, he was probably the only author I remember. So he was quite influential, like he was funny, um, pretty straight up, and was able to um, relate to us. So, um, yeah, without further ado, he's still taking it. Such a big audience. You guys got enough room there? Just get a bit closer if you need to, okay? Uh, it's nice to be here today. Um, thank you, man. That was such a warm welcome. Someone just bought me a coffee before. I was in the middle of my talk and someone just walked out and got me a coffee. Oh, great, man. The service here. That's <laughs> brilliant. <laughs> so, um, who else came last year? How you guys been? <laughs> <laughs> How you been? How's things going? Okay. Right. No problems? You know, I was the other dance at the mall. I, I'm in Whistle. I live in uh, London. So I was at the mall and I needed to use the restroom. So I wanted to use the restroom. Afterwards, you know, I wash my hands. And I go over to the hand drying machine. And they're so loud these days. You know, I put my hands in like that. You know how they're like that? Man? It's drying your hands. Well, there was other men in there, right? So there was a man behind me, there was a man over there. The man over there, he starts jumping up and down. He starts yelling and screaming. <laughs> he's just going off again. He goes up to the wall, starts hitting it with his fist. Sorry. Man, this is this, this bad. Something's going down here. What's going on with him? So then he comes right up to me and he goes, Stop it! I took my hands. And he's standing right there and I'm thinking to myself, Is he going to take a swing? You know? Is this going to get physical? Is he going to have a gun? I'm standing there and I'm like, to me and he goes, Stop it! I don't like it! It's too loud! So I'm standing there and I'm looking at him. I said to myself, I can handle this. This is okay, I'm alright. And I said, um, My hands are still there. <laughs> so I'm going to use this machine a little bit longer so I can drive. And then I'll stop. Okay? He didn't say he, he just sat there. Looking at it, went over to the toilet. So I put my hands back in. All dry now, okay? And I walked up to him and I said, Man, you have a good day. And be gentle. And walk. Because I was calm and allowed him to be calm. That was the big thing. Because I was calm and allowed him to be calm. Now I know something.